Hey guys, we're here at Universal Studios Hollywood for a Universal Studios Halloween Horror Nights update. There's some updates on the scare zone. Let's go check it out. Now here's the first house. It's called Scarecrow the Reaping. Now if you guys don't know, this is going to be original house for Hollywood Horror Nights over here in Hollywood. The actual is actually original to Universal Studios. They had it first a few years back. But it's going to be a little different over here. Hey, there's already scarecrows there on top of the roof. There's a scarecrow there. Oh, there's a scarecrow. Ours is going to be a little different. At the end, they're going to have a king scarecrow. But I'm not going to tell you... Little, that's all I'm going to tell you. There's going to be a king scarecrow at the end. I want to be a surprise for you guys. And over here to the left, on the Curious George back uh, parking lot, this is a Halloween house right here. I'm excited. This is the original Halloween house. All right, we just got off the tram, and I'm excited for the Terror Tram this year. This year it's gonna be a little different. It's gonna be hosted by Hollywood Harry. I think he's been here before, correct? He's gonna be the host. He's a clown. Michelle hates clowns. I'm excited. And uh, it's gonna be more traditional in the beginnings. Be pumpkins, uh, black cats. I think uh, bats. I think I saw bats. I'm not sure. And then it's gonna transition to. Jordan Peele's Nope and Us. The Nope, uh, Jupiter's Claim. I believe that's, it's gonna be uh, covered with uh, the characters from Us. They're, they're the ones with the knives, red suits. They look scary. I'm really excited for this year's Terror Tram. It is back, you guys. Killer Clowns from Outer Space, Killer Barbecue. Like, is this food actually good, guys? Let me know in the comments down below. I've never had this much before, first time. They're almost done. We're like two weeks away from uh, HHN. Now behind this, behind Panda Express is actually the House Killer Clowns. And I believe right next to it is going to be the Weekend House. Now I'm going to show you real quick. They actually have the Weekend Bar. They already have the signage. Let's go check that out real quick right now. Now here you go, you guys. They finally added, added the signage. The Weekend After Hours Nighttime Bar. They actually have a version of this in Orlando. Ours is gonna be upstairs. Orlando is just like a rectangle on the floor, right? I've seen footage of it online. I think I saw it on Kevin, it's a vlog. But yeah, this is our version. It's gonna be upstairs, right next to Jurassic Outfitters. Pretty sure you're gonna have your ID ready. It's gonna be awesome. Now you guys, this one I'm really, everyone's excited about this one, is uh, Universal Monsters Legends Collide. This one's going to be Dracula, the Werewolf, and the Mummy. Now this is part two actually. Orlando's going to have part one, and this one I believe is going to take place in uh, London. That's what I heard. And we actually walked by, not walked by, but we were on the escalator, on the escalator, and we saw workers down there. It could be workers, VIP, but they're... They were right in front. We're really excited. I just can't wait. So uh, we've said this once a hundred times. Do you ever think uh, Universal Studios is gonna put a uh, Treehouse of Horrors here? It'll be amazing. Everyone will love it. What do you think? I believe, I don't think they ever will, but it'll be so awesome. Now, everyone's excited about this. They announced it not too long ago, but our Hogwarts, it's gonna have the Death Eaters roaming Hogsmeade. That's the first time ever. I know Orlando has it, and I believe it's only a show. And I know, uh, is it Singapore? I think. I believe Singapore does have uh, Death Eaters. They roam, they roam around Hogsmeade. It's gonna be pretty awesome. First time ever for Hollywood to have the Death Eaters. La Llorona. This is their maze right here. It's the returning maze. I'm excited. It's pretty cool. Right next to Delian and Market. I'm scared. It looks gorgeous. Michelle said she's scared. Ah, <laughs> oh, you'll be fine. But if you grab me, I'm gonna run away. <laughs> I'm your wife. That's fine. Yeah, so after you exit, Michelle's correct. So after you exit the um, La Llorona maze, you're gonna, right, you're gonna walk right into El Pueblo de Terror. <laughs> El Pueblo de Terror uh, scare zone. It's gonna be uh, La Chupacabra. I think uh, La Llorona. Here. All of this is gonna be a scare zone. Other scary, is that a crow? Looks like a diabolical crow. It's gonna be the scare 
tractors? Is what they're gonna look like? I believe so. This is La Tupacabra. They're gonna have a La Tupacabra running around this scare zone. That's gonna be cool. Kukui. The one that they did it that was covered is the middle one. Uh huh. The Kukui. Is that long word? I can't say it. Help me out. The Cadillo. Oh, I think these are the the monsters. And it's gonna be awesome, you guys. I'm gonna be scared. I'm also bringing my sister. First time. It's gonna be a good time, you guys. There's still more they haven't finished. Now right here, you guys, the middle. It's gonna be your like your little the hub. Ooh, they added a lot. That looks amazing. You get your drinks. Right here, your alcohol. Your buzz buzz. <laughs> it's like gonna be like a little, little party area. Little party area, yeah. I bet you uh, merch is gonna be there. Plaza Plaza de Muertos. More alcohol. Oh, I think it's gonna be food actually, like a grill. Which, oh, they, they better clean that. <laughs> Do you think uh, this closes on dark at night? A black light? I think so. It'll be pretty neat. Maybe your, I believe, your slushy alcohol. Oh, you know it. I'll have your sister watch this drink while she can't. Yeah, she can't. She's <laughs> underage. <laughs> more more uh, photo ops. Sick pics. Here it is. The main star, I believe. The hub is La Llorona. This scared the bejesus out of me when I was in Mexico visiting my grandma and grandpa. There was actually a, a creek not too far uh, far away from her house, their house. And I heard noises. The legend of La Llorona. La Llorona is also known as the weeping woman. She's been a part of the Hispanic culture since the days of conquistadores. She's a tall, thin spirit said to be blessed with unnatural beauty and long, flowing black hair. She wears a white gown, roams the lakes and rivers at night. La Llorona weeps and whales as she searches for sh Hi. <laughs> you like my hair? Oh. Sorry. <laughs> I just did it. <laughs> the Bride of Frankenstein. They're permanent. They don't come off. You might not him. He's not a good guy. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. That was fun. <laughs> she like kept touching my hair. Because it looked like cotton candy, but I don't even think she knows what cotton candy is. No. So. Where was I? La Llorona, La Llorona weeps and wails as she searches for oh, sleeping children to drag screaming to a watery grave. She's bringing him over. <laughs> she was pointing at us. Hi, Frankenstein. Bride of Frankenstein. <laughs> you like my hair? I just got it done yesterday. <laughs> Beetlejuice. Do you know Michael Myers on the shirt? Never heard of him. Nope. But you're better. You're amazing. Your wife is beautiful. <laughs> I don't think she does. <laughs> She's perfect. Friend. Friend. <laughs> yes. We love you guys. <laughs>
Am I your friend? Yes, friend. We're all friends. Friend. Friend. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> friend now you guys this is another maze it's gonna be called welcome to hotel hell there's a few pictures but they haven't really explained that much have they i'm not sure but um, this used to be the walking dead so the story basically is this guy marries a wealthy woman they buy a hotel and people start dying in this hotel. A maid, then the mother-in-law, then his wife, and they all link it back to him and they execute him and before he's executed he says, I'll be back. So that's all the information he gave that he said at Midsummer Scream. You should have told this story from the <laughs> video, beginning of the video. <laughs> <laughs> now this is going to be one of the one of the scare zones is going to be side so side show slaughterhouse it's like a, a circus in a way but this year john murdy said there's not going to be a uh was a scaremony scaremony this year it's going to be a little different but it is going to involve involve the slaughterhouse characters so it's going to happen every hour at 7 45 is the first one and after that, it's going to be 9, 10, so on, so on, on top of the hour. So what does this mean? Are they going to have a stage? Are they going to be over here? Do something? I don't know. But that's all John Murdy said. If you don't know who John Murdy is, he's the creative director of HHN. And this over here was... Uh, this was actually open not too long ago. They showed characters, but they blocked it out this time. But HHN is two and a half weeks away. The first one is September 8th. September 8th, we will be here for the first time ever. This little walkway right here is going to be the clown saws. That's what they call them. It's going to be clowns with li literally chainsaws. Not, not real ones, but they're going to chase you around with chainsaws. All around this walkway. <laughs> Like I mentioned before, Michelle is afraid of clowns. Now the final house is going to be actually on the side of uh, Waterworld. It's going to be over there somewhere. Now it's going to be a combination of two houses. It's going to be Blumhouse Productions. It's going to be Freaky and Black Phone. We have yet to see both of those movies, so I know they're scary, but I don't know how scary. I heard it's really scary, but they're going to be right there in the corner, uh, those two houses. That's where it used to be Halloween, I think, last year. But now it's going to be Black Phone and Freaky. All right, guys, uh, what houses are you excited for this year? I'm excited for Killer Clowns. Michelle's excited for Universal Monsters Legends Collide. That's with the Dracula, Werewolf, and the Mummy, I believe. Yes, yes correct. That's her she's excited for. Let us know in the comments down below which one's your favorite. And uh, that is it, you guys. Thank you for watching. We are the Duque family. Well, two of us on here today. <laughs> Subscribe. Hit that bell. That will let you know our, uh, our video is up. And uh, if you're not following us on Instagram, that will let you know. <laughs> well, we put a lot of content on there that we don't post on the YouTube channel. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>